should be covering my hair and considering stuff like that and who's allowed to touch it and who's not and that you can't shake my hand not out of respect or that you don't want to. Just... This is the prayer of guidance, okay? As Muslims, we recite this multiple times a day, right? It says, in the name of Allah, the most compassionate, the most merciful, all praise is... Hello guys, you're welcome, thanks for clicking. So she never saw herself becoming a Muslim until this happened. So let's check it out. Did you write the book? Huh? Did you write the book? No, no, no. I, I basically just hand out everything for free. I just educate people about Islam and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've learned a lot about Islam. I went, do you know Hampshire, Michigan? Are you familiar with Oh, uh, yes. I'm familiar with Michigan, yes. I've been there. Okay, nice. Nice, nice, nice. I think it's a, it's a pretty large uh, Muslim community out there. Interesting. Have you ever read the Quran before? Never. Well, do you mind if I give you a free copy? I would love it. Okay, beautiful. It's a gift for me to you. Yeah, thank you. Yes, absolutely. So are you a, a believer? Are you a believer in Christ? Or yeah, yeah, 100%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I so, just yeah. Sure. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. So, so, I, I, so I don't know if you're uh, familiar with the Muslim belief, but as Muslims, we believe in Jesus. We believe Jesus is the Son of Mary. Right. We believe Jesus is the Messiah, sent right. by God. What The thing is, uh, the difference between us and the Christians, or a certain denomination of Christianity, we just don't believe Jesus is God, and nor do we believe Jesus is the Son of God. But we believe that Jesus is the Messiah sent from God, and we believe in all His miracles as well, but we believe that all the miracles were, uh, uh, you know, were by by the Creator. Okay, so you follow you follow Muhammad more than Jesus. Yes, I mean, but okay. we we believe that this is also the teachings of Jesus as well. That Jesus also said to worship the Father, that He is the true God. So, so do you believe Jesus died for you? No, no, no. we, we do not believe. Yeah, yeah. So okay. we don't believe in so the crucifixion of Jesus. Okay. Yeah, that would be another big difference. We don't believe Jesus is God. We don't believe Jesus is the Son of God because we don't believe Almighty God has children. He's different than His creation. And also, we don't believe that Jesus was crucified. We believe that it appeared as if He was crucified, but it wasn't. That He wasn't crucified, um, and someone else was crucified instead of Him. Okay. Yeah. 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 Well, I follow Jesus. Yeah, no problem. I, I, as, as Muslims, we believe that we're followers of Jesus yeah. as well. Yes, yeah. Isa. Isa, yes. Isa. Yeah. Well, thank you for this. No problem, no problem. All right. Have a good one. Bless Take care, guys. Oh, yes, I do have something that's funny. What's your name? Okay, my name is Wahab. Nice to meet you. This is a gift from me to you, okay? Okay, thank yes, you. Yes, yes, yes. I love it. My, my sister in law. Huh? See, my sister in law, she, she has this religion in Colombia. Okay, beautiful, beautiful. So I tried to find this book, uh -huh. and I never in Spanish, and I'm lucky today. SubhanAllah, SubhanAllah. Well, you know what? As Muslims, we do not believe in coincidences. We believe everything happens for a reason, so I don't believe our meeting was an accident. Reason, would I come in here today? Yes, 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 yes. Thank you. No problem. I have one more gift for you, okay? I, I want to offer you a prayer mat from the holy city of Mecca. What color do you like, my dear sister? Go ahead. It's a gift from me to you, okay? And then along with it is a prayer manual that teaches you how to worship, okay? How to pray, okay? So it's a bag. And then inside is a travel mat, okay? okay can so I it's, put yeah, of course, right? of course, of course. Hey, look, it matches the book too, huh? Oh yeah. Awesome, okay. awesome. All right, sounds good, my dear sister. Uh, God bless you. I hope you have a wonderful day, okay? Amen. Thank you. No so problem. Much. No problem. No problem. Take care, okay? Okay. All right. Have a good one. Bye. Bye. Inside, yes. Okay. So, uh, what is the name of this? Oh, this is called a prayer mat. Prayer mat. Okay, yeah. So, so you I just put, put it on the ground, ground, yeah, and then you use it to pray to Almighty God. <laughs> Thank you. Beautiful. Thank you. No problem, no problem, okay? It's beautiful, right? Yeah. Yes, yes. And I love the color. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. It's a gift from me to you, okay? okay yes. Awesome. Thank you, thank you. Hello. I came 47 miles looking for you on barbed wire. Subhanallah, subhanallah. What's your name? My name is Shakir Dakhil. MashaAllah, Abdul Wahab. Nice to meet you. I know you, of course. I know. <laughs> I'm a good follower of you. So so I congratulate you. Thank you, my brother. Man, you're really doing a great job. Thank you, brother. Thank my you, brother. son, Brahim. No? How are you doing, brother? Orig Origin from Libya. Mashallah. May yeah. Allah bless the people of Libya. Mashallah. 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 Sorry, sorry. Oh, you can. Yeah, yeah, yeah. How are okay. you guys doing? How you guys doing? What brought you guys so over? So thank you so much for educating people about their religion. Boy, could you mention that again? I didn't hear that. What did you oh, say? Oh, I said thank you so much for educating people about the religion. Oh, of like course. That, like, of in course. In a formative way that's not like... You How know, did you hear about me? Aren't you on TikTok? Or YouTube? I, I am, I am, I am. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, beautiful. Well, <laughs> okay, awesome, awesome, awesome. Nice man. to meet you. So, Absolutely, nice to meet you as well. What's your I, name? Nadia. Nadia, okay, my yeah. name is Wahab. Nice to meet you. What's your name, brother? Marco. Huh? Marco. Marco, okay, Wahab, nice to meet you. So, what brought you guys over? 
Uh, I'm just interested. I've always been kind of interested in learning more about religions in general. And okay. Most of them is just something that kind of interests me, so I want to okay. learn more about it. Okay. Well, welcome, welcome. Um, yeah. Do you have any questions on the top of your mind, by, by any chance? Uh, the Quran's free. Yes, everything is 100% free. Yeah, yes. but I feel too bad taking this. This is too nice. No, no, no. It's, I, I insist. I insist on, you know, giving out the gifts so that way you guys can be educated. Yes, absolutely, my dear brother. Absolutely. So do you know anything about Islam? Yeah, like, uh... uh well, I've only started learning because of you, really, but I've always been more interested in it. It's just the stuff that I find, it's like, it doesn't feel as comfortable and as natural as the stuff you kind of be putting out. So, I'm like barely dipping my toes in the water. Like, I know I should be covering my hair and considering stuff like that, and who's allowed to touch it and who's not, and that you can't shake my hand not out of respect or that you don't want to. It's just a difference of religion. Absolutely, absolutely. But you just have to understand, like, it's a journey between you and your creator. It's yeah. not between you and anyone else. So you do things at your own pace, and you have to remember, whenever you do something, do it strictly for the sake of your creator, not for anyone else. You understand? So when you're re whenever you are ready to make those steps, do it for the sake of your creator. You understand? And it's gonna it's gonna bring a lot of peace in your life. Do you mind if I share with you a little bit about Islam, my dear sister? Yeah, sure. Okay, beautiful. So Islam simply means submission to the Almighty Creator. A Muslim is the one who submits their will to the Almighty Creator. So as Muslims, we have a very simple belief that there's only one Creator, and only that Creator is worthy of worship. And that's why I'm so interested in Islam because I went to Catholic school for like eight or nine years, but okay. I totally can get into the concept that there is just one Creator. And yes. That it, it really doesn't matter who you think it is as long as you're... Worshipping your that creator. Yeah, exactly. Yes. And doing what you can to make that person... And you know, we believe that is a straight path, right? Yeah. If you don't mind, I can share with you actually one of the first chapters of the Quran. If you want to open up uh, page number one of the Quran, I'll go ahead and recite it for you in Arabic, and I'll translate it for you in English. And this is actually the prayer of guidance. As Muslims, we read this at least, I think, uh, about uh, over 10 times a day. You know, um, so I'll go ahead. Huh? Like that? Uh, what is that with the water? Wadu? Wadu, yes, yeah, yes, yes. yes. That, that's, that? yeah, yeah, absolutely. So that's before is that we pray. Oh, uh, no, no, so that's my drinking water. That's my drinking There's water. The holy water. <laughs> the holy water. <laughs> it's at home, it's at home in Mecca, oh, you know what I mean? <laughs> absolutely. So I'll go ahead and share with you. So it's the first page, so it's page number one. All right. Okay? So page number one, uh, I think there's a few more pages, and then you'll find it. So first of all, I'll do my dear sister. Is, have you ever seen the original Quran by any chance? The yeah, this is the original Quran right here in Arabic. Oh, in Arabic? Okay. Yeah, and then that's the translated version in English, okay? Yeah. So I'll go ahead and recite it for you in, in Arabic, and then I'll go ahead and translate it for you in English. Okay, there you go, that's the page right yeah, there. Thank you. Okay. Okay. <laughs> So this is the prayer of guidance, okay? As Muslims, we recite this multiple times a day, right? It says, in the name of Allah, the most compassionate, the most merciful, all praises for Allah, Lord of all worlds, the most compassionate, most merciful, master of the day of judgment. You alone we worship. You alone we ask for help. Guide us along the straight path, the path of those that you have blessed, not those that you are displeased with or those who are astray. So this is a prayer of guidance, my dear sister. That as Muslims, you know, we read that multiple times a day. Is this your first time uh, getting a copy of the Quran? Yeah, this is like the first time I feel comfortable enough to approach it. Okay. That's why I'm saying like your videos are really informative for people who are at least interested in getting to know this lot more. Absolutely, but absolutely. I know that religion isn't anything about like forcefulness or like you can't pick and choose. Like it really is doable. You just have to give your life, not give your life, but you know, like the only thing that I kind of have a hang up on is not yeah, sure, sure. to show your hair. And I seen a video of you talking to a girl specifically who didn't want to show cover her hair you said you don't have to do that right away you have to it comes with acceptance it comes, and, it comes yeah, with time you have to understand yeah. as you learn more about your creator as you fall in love with your creator naturally you're going to want to worship your creator and, do and listen can. and do yeah. what you do and you have to remember okay, so. the creator he doesn't create rules for no reason he creates his rules on purpose right in order to protect us like for instance gambling right some people you know when they gamble maybe they lose fifty dollars and they're done then there's other people who gamble and lose millions of dollars they lose their family they lose their house 
They lose everything and they end up losing their own life. You understand? So Allah has created limits on us for a reason in order to protect us, right? When it comes to modesty of a woman, right? The reason why it is, my dear sister, there's many reasons for it, but it's for men to not uh, uh, view you in a sexual manner. So they uh, appreciate you for who you are instead of what you look like. You understand? And... Uh, Huh? Thank you so much. Of course. Going no, you have an appointment at the no, no problem. No problem. I'll lift off you, you so a, 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 another few gifts, my dear sister. A brief you. illustrated guy. I'll lift off of your prayer mat, please. I can't. I can't. There's Why not? Why not? Why not? Why not? Okay. Really Beautiful. Okay. So take care. Okay. Uh, let me give you one more thing, my dear sister. I'm going to give you a prayer manual that teaches you how to oh, pray. Okay. God. Beautiful. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. I'd love to offer you guys a prayer. I'd love to offer. Would you like a prayer mat, my dear brother? You sure? Okay. Sounds good, guys. Well, I hope you have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for stopping by, okay? Take care. Take care. Okay, well, all I could say from this video is the fact that people were eager to learn about, curious about Islam, just wanted to know more information about Islam, and they got the, you know, the Quran, the books, and, you know, the first person that came asked so many questions. What are the things Islam does not believe compared to what Christianity believes? And he said something that got my attention when he said, they don't believe that Jesus was crucified. He said of him, somebody else was crucified in his place and not Jesus. I was like, Woof. that's my first time hearing that part of the, the, the whole thing. Or maybe the man was in a hurry to give his explanation because I've never heard any Muslim man say that the reason why Jesus was not crucified because somebody else was crucified instead of Jesus. How? I need more explanation on that. Every, every other thing he explained are not new to me because we all know that Jesus is called Isa. You know, we all know that Muslim does not believe Jesus is Lord. You know, there are a lot of differences between Christianity and Islam. And the last person who was you know, curious, she she got to understand what Islam was. And the last person, the lady and the guy, he explained a lot about Islam to them. Even though, to me, they don't they don't want to learn Islam to convert. They just want to know the religion. There are some people that they are willing to learn about religions, but that doesn't mean they want to be in that religion. They've been hearing a lot about that religion, so they just want to have more idea about the religion. And some along the line convert later why some they just read it to get knowledge about the religion so this lady she's not a muslim but she's ready to learn about islam she wanted to know much the man was willing to offer the prayer mat i said no that is to tell you that she's interested in the religion but she's not doing it to be in the religion to convert to the religion but regardless of that that was a beautiful one the, 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 the kindness this man do show every time on his on his video trying to promote you know Islam is something beautiful to watch it's something I love about Muslims it's something that I want to be seeing more in other religion like Christianity that's one thing Islam uh, Muslims don't joke with they know how to publicize you know talk about preach the word of Allah preach about the Quran and that was beautiful to watch. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.